All right, guys, remember the Fiji water girl, the one who photobombed celebs on the red carpet at the Golden Globes? Well, she goes by her model name, Kelleth Cuthbert. Now the internet sensation is suing Fiji water, saying the company created cardboard cutouts of her without her permission. She says she did not sign away rights to her likeness and claims the water company tried pressuring her to do so with a fake document and gifts. Well, Fiji water says the lawsuit is frivolous and without merit, but we have our Law Vegas Now expert, Eric Palacios, here to break it all down. So this is such an interesting story when it comes to likeness and image. We know we are always on TV, camera, wherever we go. My likeness is actually owned by this station. So can anyone use my image without my permission? The answer is yes and no and what the purpose of that usage okay. is. If you're out in public and somebody takes a picture of a crowd or even if you puts it on Instagram, on Facebook, normally that's okay. Mm -hmm. You're out in public and it's implied consent that it's okay to take your picture. So just being in public, it's implied that you're, so no matter if you have a contract or not. That, that's correct. As okay. long as they're not using it for monetary purpose and okay. it's just you're part of the crowd and somebody took a picture and, and somehow it was posted. But if it's being used to generate uh, money or, or to say that you are promoting a product, then they specifically need your permission. I gotcha. And so what can we do if that pops up on the internet or somewhere? Well, uh, for instance, uh, this uh, model that was working the red carpet mm -hmm. event, all of a sudden she's gone viral. It, yes. It's kind of funny. Uh, everybody's uh, taking an interest in it. That probably wasn't anticipated. Mm -hmm. And in her original contract, she, she was going to be near the cameras. It's probably uh, agreed to that she might appear uh, on certain websites mm -hmm. uh, or the internet or yeah, TV, that kind of okay. thing. But uh, the subsequent use, when there's alleged cutouts that they're using for additional promotion, if she did not agree to that, then yes, Fiji would not be allowed to do that. So that right now there's conflicting stories. Mm -hmm. Fiji says they have her authorization. There was a later contract signed where okay. she agreed to this. She is saying that she did not. So we'll see what well, pans out. Well, this later contract that she signed, she's claiming, I guess, that it was just a mock-up of a document. Like, it, it wasn't really legal, and they, they wanted her to sign it, which she did. Well, <laughs> it's going to have to be ferreted out uh, in the litigation to see uh, who's right and what, did, what she did sign mm -hmm. and uh, if Fiji is okay to use her likeness or if they're going to have to pay for that. So I guess the moral of the story, don't sign anything unless you know exactly what you are signing. Now, is, is it common for this to happen? I guess if she does go viral, then, I mean, you have to drop a new contract if she's the new Fiji if girl. If you're going to continue with it, and in, in most in instances when this happens, you do. You get the momentum and you, mm -hmm. you have the added publicity, so the companies think it's a good idea to continue uh, with this. Mm -hmm. So in that uh, event, if that happens, then yes, yeah, sit down with the person and say, hey, this went a different way than we anticipated. Yeah. Let's uh, sign a different contract and compensate you so we can continue to use your image. Yeah, hopefully this will be a good learning experience, not only for her, but for a lot of people in the industry. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. If you want more information, any legal advice, too, you can give Eric Palacios and Associates a call, 702-444-7777. You can also visit their website at ericpalacios.com.